Hey, fellow buddies, thanks for watching. All right, this video is going to be a little bit different. Um, I'm going to say if you have one of these listed, I would remove this item now. And I'm going to tell you why I'm saying that. But first, I want to tell you my name is Courtney, also known as Bolo Buddies. On this channel, I typically talk about items to be on the lookout for bolo items in this video i'm gonna tell you an item that you should not bolo for ebay is buckling down on this one all of a sudden and we're gonna go right into that after my trailer hey bolo buddies thanks for watching i'm gonna tell you where they got it what they paid for it and what it sold for Amazing, right? All right, let's get started. Okay, so uh, in my Facebook group, somebody posted, this has been a, a probably a couple weeks ago, I have a post up that says share an item that got removed from eBay or share a Vero. And I am doing videos that look like this. And definitely go check out that series because these are current issues affecting resellers on eBay. So I've invited my Facebook group members to go in and share on that post. And then I create a video telling you guys issues that people are having, items that are getting removed. Really, really important current time. Today in the Facebook group, I'm going to show you what I saw. And before I saw this, I also got a notification that mine were taken down. So, and I'm going to show you my email also that I got from eBay about it. But let's go ahead and screen share here. And I am already in my Bolo Buddies Facebook group. If you're not in the group, definitely go join. But this is what she wrote. I was very excited to buy three boxes of vintage Noma bubble lights for a dollar at a yard sale. In their original boxes, boxes are beat up. I figured they didn't work. Tested the bulbs and 10 work. Listed them on eBay. Planned to list the other two for parts and their boxes. Big no-no that I didn't know because I saw so many listings and solds. And she's 100% right. Like people have always sold these. I really think this is a new thing that eBay is buckling down on. But she said, apparently they violate eBay's hazardous materials policy for containing methane. Is that how you say it? Chloride? I had no idea. eBay removed my listing, thought I would share. So no one else has an issue. And this is what they look like. So they're the bubble lights. You plug them in and they bubble. They're really, really cool. They are vintage. And um, yeah, I... I don't know what's going on. Uh, here is the other one. This one is from Terry Mindful Recycle. She said she just had the same thing happen. She had four boxes that she had listed. These are totally different. You can see here, these are a different brand, but again, bubble lights. So if you have these, I recommend that you pull them and take them off of eBay. Okay. From what I understand so far, nobody has got a suspension for this. They are giving you a warning. I got a warning. But I wanted to show you this from um, YouTuber Rachel Strickland. Over on her Instagram, she posted this video. Have you ever had to call poison control while you were listing something on eBay? I broke one of these vials from these vintage bubble lights once, and that was exactly what I had to do. I got it on my skin. The lady at poison control said that I needed to make sure the whole area was well ventilated and to rinse my skin because the liquid inside of these vintage lights is toxic. Have okay. So that was something that Rachel put out. I really didn't think too much of it. I just thought, don't break it, you know? So apparently uh, these are getting hit hard right now on eBay. So if you have any of these bubble lights up, I would take them down because I, I saw her post and I'm going to say, I don't know how many people, but there were a ton of people that had also recently got a violation. And it looks like 
it's for different brands and types. So I don't think it matters. I think whatever probably makes them bubble is toxic, considered a hazardous material, and they do not want us selling them anymore. So take them down. Uh, another item that is not allowed to be listed on eBay. Okay, Bolo Buddies, I'm gonna pop up screen shares of the email that I received from eBay when they removed my listing. Again, I just got a warning, um, no suspension or anything like that. If anybody has had a suspension for hazardous material bubble lights, please let me know in the comments, or please let me know if you've had this item removed recently because it seems to be over the past couple weeks that it's really been um, becoming an issue. So if you are not familiar with what bubble lights are, this is what they look like when they are plugged in and they heat up, they bubble just like this. So if you have these listed currently, um, I would definitely take those down. And here is my actual eBay listing that I had listed. And here is the info that I had in my description. And this was pulled. And you can see right here, it says your listing was removed for hazardous materials policy. And then I'm just going to show you the what it says exactly in the email. I'm pretty sure everybody gets the same email, but you guys can pause and actually read through this if you would like. It will attach which item was in violation for you, so you have that. Um, I don't even believe that it's in your sold listings. It's completely gone, um, but those... Um, the different hazardous materials are also listed here. So familiarize yourself with this. And uh, yeah, I, I would take these down for sure because lots and lots of people are getting this uh, removal at this current time. So again, go check out this series right here. This is my most recent one. There's gonna be more coming in the future. Here are some of the other videos in this series. If you just type in Bolo Buddies Vero into the YouTube search, that should pull these up, but these are the thumbnails that you should be looking for. But also check out some of my videos of items to be on the lookout for, items to buy low and sell high. So like I said, I talk about big money bolos, items to be on the lookout for. I feature other people. I also show you my big money bolos. I also choose categories and I research those categories and bring you a bolo category video. So be sure to check out my channel for tons and tons and tons of bolo content. Um, another thing that I do are my bread and butter bolos, which these are my sales that I sell for $35 or less. These items are easier to find, so check out that series as well. Hey, I'm gonna pop up some videos here and here and a subscribe and a video below. I'd love for you to subscribe if you're new here and thanks for watching.